ESPN joins us now with some special memories of a very special lady, Mary Martin. And Bobby, I know that in her passing you feel a, a personal loss here. Oh, Brad, indeed I do. You know, through the years, Mary and I became friends. It was always like, you know, a couple of down-home Texas <laughs> girls sitting around talking. It's no wonder she loved Peter Pan. Mary Martin was Peter Pan. She had a childlike enthusiasm and an endless outpouring of love. And how she could laugh. In recent years, she'd roar when people said, aren't you JR's mother? They were referring, of course, to her son, Larry Hagman, who is JR on Dallas. Mary Martin loved coming home to Texas. This 1959 news footage shows Mary and her husband, Richard Halliday, being greeted at Carter Field by Mary's sister, Mrs. Robert R. Andrews. Mary never called her Jerry. She always called her sister. They were extremely close until sister's death several years ago. I shall always remember when my husband died four and a half years ago, one of the most comforting letters came from Mary Martin. She'd been widowed 10 years before, so she knew the pain. Ironically, Mary Martin and my husband both died from liver cancer. My last visit with Mary Martin was in February of 89 when she was in Dallas to present an award to Jimmy Stewart. She told me some great stories about Peter Pan, like when she was flying with the children in rehearsal with a new man handling the wires. One time, instead of pulling her back, he let her crash into the wall. What had happened is the man who had not seen Peter Pan, believed I could fly. So he didn't, he didn't pull any back. He, I, he just believed. Her arm was broken, but two months later it healed and Mary resumed rehearsals. And I, I'm flying here, I get over to this wall, this, the same wall I've hit. And there was a huge mattress on it at the top of the theater and it said, Mary Martin slapped here. <laughs> Another time in San Francisco, she flew into the wings and disappeared at the top of the theater three stories high. The crew could not get her back, so they called the fire department. And the fire department kept saying, Miss Mary, Mary, Mary. <laughs> and I said, I'm up somewhere in the top. So they had to bring all the fire, fire things and if I, I was hanging at the top of the theater. I never looked at it. Went right back and started flying again. Mary Martin was great fun and intensely so I loyal. I shall always remember the last word she spoke to me in that interview. Isn't it marvelous to have friendship this long? Yes, yes, I cherish beginning. it. I cherish it. Me too. Thanks, Mary. Thank you, darling. Mary Martin will never leave us. Thanks to home videos, Peter Pan is here for us to enjoy now and to pass on to our future generations. You can just hear how much you're going to miss her. Oh, yep. Thanks a lot. Lots Bobby. of people, not just me. Absolutely. Thanks very much for sharing that with us.